probably he probably the greatest defender I've seen in my life. Okay. Even including Ray. Man, Reed. I love him. Like, Reed's the guy. Ed, Ed Reed ain't normal, man. He playmaker, man. man. Playmaker. He, listen, they used to line him up on the line and he used to block punts. You can't just do that. Like he knew that he knew the other team played. Like I remember uh, Bill Belichick was like, yo, we ran a play. We just let the guy we went throwing the ball to the run pass because we knew what we was doing. Dang. That that's Dang. Yeah, we, that's different. Harry was different. And if he catch it, he's trying to go to the house. Yes. Dog, I think uh, Air Reed is the he probably my favorite player on defense of all time for sure. Or besides Wilson, but uh, yeah, like okay. for, for me, if I got a if I got a defensive back there, my personal preference is give me Charles and Champ and give me Troy Palomalo and Harry. we'll figure everything else out. Yeah, Palomalo sounds he he's gonna get enough he, he, right. he's a beast. So you sure. didn't mention Prime, but one, why is Prime rated so high? And what did you see that you wouldn't put him in your backfield or just with some flaws or some things that was glossed over? Because Prime was smart. He making business decisions. He ain't going out there to tackle nobody. But Prime, like, Prime was so good at covering that sometimes the quarterback when he's looking inside the field. That's crazy. That's crazy, but but if you do a toss sweep over there, oh, I know what you're saying. Or you, you throw a tight end dump on on prime fast, you might try to catch him from behind. But he's not going to be tackling guys like that. Okay. Now Charles, oh. they play complete football game. Left shoulder tackle, right shoulder tackle. They can take the hit the best way. They can play crazy corner. They can play outside linebacker in the blitz. They can do every single thing that you're asking me. And oh, okay. that's good. Prime simply just, I'm going to take this receiver away and don't look over here. Don't look over here. Or else I'm going to take to the house. <laughs> is there, any, is there any corner today that you see that, not saying that's better than those guys, or that you would say is holding up to the standard? Um, I you like, like Jalen, but Jalen has been getting burnt. He has yeah. four years. fast the receivers you do here. I, I think Patrick Peterson is the most physically gifted corner I've ever seen. His footwork ain't always mm. great, but he gonna follow everybody everywhere, which is why your numbers sometimes get you know get a little bit skewed. And then at safety, I don't even know how Tyron Matthews plays football in the field. He's little than the most. He's small, man. I don't even know how he does it, but he yeah, does. I see a safety. That's, he's small, uh, but he plays. Like it's crazy. He's gonna find the ball. He I don't even think he's paying attention to the call in the defense with her. I really don't. What's the guy from I'm trying to think of was it Alexander from uh the page I mean from the Packers? Uh ah, the left corner. Yeah. He he straight we got I mean, it's hard to play corner now because you can't touch the guy. Like, and and you talk about that's why corners are the best athletes on the field. You want me to run backwards? Why this guy get to run for, or forward? And, then got, and run for it. And, uh, like, what are we doing here? That's the rule. Yeah, Jerry, uh, Dre said Jerry Alexander. That's what he's talking yeah, about. Yeah, Jerry Alexander. Yeah, he up there for sure. The boy, I'm up, I'm like him. So Dre no, no. Uh, Dre said, he said, in other words, Dion the best corner and Chuck uh, Woodson the best defensive back. What you basically saying, right? He, I'll tell you about the best that. Cover to ever he's the best I, cover corner to ever leave. Right, right. Okay. Guys brought up. I want you to just tell me about them. 